Hello, welcome back to the channel. I don't know if you guys have ever been behind the barn. And today, we have to pour a freaking slab. I've only done once a while ago. We have something coming from Ben to pack that I am putting in a shed outside, so I don't have to listen to it. That shows up tomorrow. So we have to get this slab poured. So when it shows up, it'll be dry and we can bolt that said thing to the slab. I think this will all be in one video, but I figured I'd start the video off. You guys can watch me sweat and probably put too much water into the concrete and make it really soupy. We'll get it figured out. Thank you guys so much for the support in the last video. I can't thank you guys enough. Also, thank you for the support on the discounted quick loop shirts. We are almost sold out. So the sooner they sell out, the quicker we can get to the next shirts. Get right to work. I have 10 bags of 5,000 PSI concrete from quick Crete, shovel and a wheelbarrow and no muscles. <laughs> so it's going to be a fun one, but should be pretty easy. I already have the form built. I'll show you in a second. Oh my God. My neighbor's dog is sleeping in my yard. What are you doing? What are you doing, Harlow? <laughs> what a cutie boy. All right, let's get to work. All right, so we have a three foot by six foot form made. Hi, Arlo. Hi, buddy. All right, so we have three foot by six foot form made. Um, I do have to dig it out though. Definitely got washed out a little bit. So dig some of this stuff out and we'll get right to work. I also need to power wash the side of the garage. It's disgusting. It doesn't get any light back here. So let's get right to it. No dicking around today, boys. later think we have enough I just have to smooth it out now uh, I think I'm like one bag short it's pretty level I'm gonna give it a broom finish but uh, I wish I had one more bag I think it'd be perfect that was an 80 pound bag so let's just try a little bit and then we'll broom finish it smooth it all out should be good to go uh, I never have enough concrete I should have known I should have known Ooh little cinematic shot by accident. Just gonna leave it, it's okay. I think the frame rate slowed down a little bit, but we'll leave it for this clip. Good morning, it rained last night and we poured the concrete last night. So we're gonna go check it out and see if it all washed away or not because strong possibility that it did. Anyway, welcome back to today's video. We have another garage update showing up and uh, this one is gonna be a good one. Let's go check out the slab. All right, I haven't looked yet. Uh, it's got a lot of water on it, but I think. I think it survived. Oh, thank God. I can't even remember if I told you guys why we did this, but we're putting a shed up here. Or the thing that's showing up today. I feel like I'm talking quiet this morning. It's all good. Just finished editing light video, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's a really fun one to make and the transformation was so sick. Let's get this water off. Actually, you're gonna help me. Guess I have a low spot. <laughs> All right, pick this back up in a minute. Goodbye. I'm interrupting today's video to thank today's sponsor, Ridge Wallets. If you've considered buying one, now's your chance because they've teamed up with Hennessy to give away a bad to the bone Bronco. You can enter for free and get bonus entries for every dollar spent. I personally love the Alpine Navy RFID blocking wallet and matching key case, but with over 30 colors to choose from, I'm sure there's one that you'd like. The Ridge team is so confident that they'll even let you test drive it for 99 days. And if you don't like it, you can send it back for a full refund. Enter for free at ridge.com forward slash grant and get additional entries for every dollar spent. Plus, if you use my link, you'll get 10 bonus entries and use my code grant for 10% off your order. Thanks to Ridge for sponsoring this channel. Now back to the video. How'd I do, my mano? Pretty good, not bad. Not too bad. First integration done, baby. I have something massive showing up today and I'm glad Chris is here because I am absolutely not gonna be able to move it myself because it weighs, Chris, it weighs 985 pounds. <laughs> it's huge. It's massive. The size of a K car. So that's showing up shortly, but I'm not even gonna say because you guys are gonna make fun of me. I'm gonna mop, I'm gonna mop the garage and 
get the rest of it cleaned up so it's spotless. The new thing shows up for what we poured the pad for, and then we have to get to work in the E36 because we leave in less than a week for Kentucky. We also need lunch. Kinda want a hot dog. You want a hot dog? <laughs> Good old fashioned glizzy with my boy. Brother, look at that unit. How's that thing look? It's a big boy. <laughs> it's a big boy. Let's go check this thing out. I didn't know it came with a disconnect box on it already. That's nice. That is really nice. So this is, I don't know the exact name of the compressor, but it's seven and a half horsepower, V-twin, 230 volt, 80 gallon. It's a, it's a big boy. It's a two stage. How big this freaking motor is. This thing is gangster, huh, Chris? Oh, look at that, it's got a freaking Harley motor on her. Now you understand why we poured that slab the other day. This is what's going on the slab, and we're building a shed around it, so it's outside, out of the elements, quiet. These things are really quiet. I think it's like 75 decibels, which I'm convinced my little compressor is like 100 decibels. It is so damn loud. Oh, here is the breakdown, if anybody was curious. Chris, we have a nice compressor now. We can paint cars illegally. Dude, <laughs> Dude this thing's gonna kick off once a day. That's it. Don't, Dude, this thing. Oh, I'm fired up. Fired up, brother. My whole life I've had used junk. <laughs> so it's really nice to have new pieces of equipment that I can maintain from day one. Do you, if that, does that make sense? Like my whole life I've just had old shit that I've had to repair. So if I can just, I'm, I'm really good at maintenance. So if I can just maintain my new stuff, I'm gonna be set. I'm gonna be all set. <sighs> Can't thank Ben Pack enough. This is such a treat. Let's go check out how the slab looks now that it's dried. I think it's mostly dry. Damn, dried up pretty well. I think there's gonna be plenty of space to put the compressor on one side or the yeah, other. Yeah. And then I'll still have a little bit of storage. I should have built it a little bigger. <laughs> but then how big do you really go? You know what I mean? If you went any bigger, it'd be a freaking another right. room off. You need to realize I did this just for the compressor, and if I can fit brooms, rakes, shovels, anything else in here, it'll be fine. We poured some concrete, boys. All right, let's figure out how we're gonna move this. I need to clean up back here too. It is an absolute mess. All right, time to try to move this thing. Uh, we cleared out all the junk that was around the slab out back. So we're gonna try to move it from here and put it directly onto the slab so we don't have to move it again. My tractor is very small though, so we'll see how this goes. <laughs> kind of nervous, but we'll be all right. Up. I know, it's very front heavy right now. Chris, why did that work so easy? That was so easy, dude. Okay, it looks like it's gonna fit a lot better on the slab than I thought it was, so we should be good to go. I'm gonna stand in front of you. That way. Try it that yeah. way. Let's get this here. Oh. Woo! Boo, boo, boo. Oh. All right, we're good, we're good. Put okay. it out all the way. And then take this block of wood, Chris, yeah. and put it on the dirt. Okay. I got you, I got you, I got you. <laughs> Dude, almost good. We definitely almost put a hole through the side of it. Dude, we almost <laughs> blew the f***ing head off this thing. <laughs> Chris, I have work. never seen you run so fast in my entire Dude, life. I just, like, I first one second, I had the most, like, worst case scenario <laughs> in my head. <laughs> <laughs> you ran so fast, I didn't even see you get to the you other know, side of the compressor. The thing went through my head was like, I hope he knows his insurance policy. I think I would have saved it, but still, I was like, oh, oh no. We got a snap-on box. We had a little detour we had to make, and it was a deal that I could not pass up. So, got one little upgrade from my 
US General, little rolling cart. Got this big boy. I know, doesn't match, but for the deal I got, I couldn't say no. Time to swap all the tools over. We also got a grinder on a stand, which is going to be, I guess it's a sander, not a grinder. Sander on a stand, which is gonna be sick. So it's big tool day here at the shop, right? Right, GT? Not bad for 10 grand. <laughs> yeah, right. Imagine that. Imagine if I had that kind of money in general, my JZX would be finished. All right, let's uh, let's keep plugging away. This place is, I'm not gonna say it. It's a mess again, bye. Good morning. I'm just gonna start off by saying I apologize that this video has been filmed throughout the last couple days. I feel like I have had like a weird spot of not knowing what to film. But we've gotten a lot done in the last few days. Um, and maybe that's just what I needed to get back in action. So I'm gonna continue this video along and today is going to be so damn fun. We're going to ride the jet ski for the first time all year. Loaded up with GoPro, I got this camera. We're gonna get the jet ski on the truck and we're gonna head to our buddy's house who has a house right on the lake all crazy freestyle jet skis. It's, it's gonna be really cool. I can't wait to bring you guys along. thing strapped down and get on the road ready for the lake it is like the nut the warmest day of the summer right now so freaking stoked also if i look tired it's because i am tired just putting it out there all right let's do this all my friends are riding motorcycles today and i'm going on the lake this is literally the first time this year i'm going to ride my jet skis so motorcycles i can ride forever jet skis gets cold really quick now at night so uh i'm gonna take advantage of the nice weather while i can and we're gonna go hit the lake baby i'm freaking pumped all right we made it momano's got his little 550 Look who it is, the world's, up, the, world's like <laughs> the world's cheapest FRS owner. What is this thing? Oh God, what are your truck? No, 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 no. <laughs> El Crater is the name of this truck. Dude, the frame is Dude, they don't know McCarthy, but we got something spicy coming in in a couple weeks. For what? Oh, the you know, what? Beep. Oh yeah, yeah, edit that out. Let's see. Wow, it is, it is high, really right? nice. Yeah, Glad to see it's up to date on registration. <laughs> it is nice. How's it run? Oh, it runs good. Oh, you you put a bigger engine in, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, yeah. let's get these things in the water. Mamano, get your beach cart. When do you see this thing, McCarthy? Looks like it was built at Home Depot. I'm just kidding. I can't even talk shit. I don't have one, so. You ready for this? I want to see your reaction. Oh, you ready? Was this a Craigslist deal? Yeah. Oh, well, I'm surprised you didn't get it from no, one of your Mark Tinder <laughs> girlfriends. <laughs> Look at Justin. Oh Look at my God. He got a Home Depot gift card for Christmas <laughs> and went there and bought it. <laughs> oh, he hit second in the driveway, dude. Two seconds in and they're already doing backflips. Who's going? There we go. Not a backflip, but not bad. Oh yeah. God damn, dude. Oh, combo. <laughs> one day I'll be there. Not today, but one day. Uh, hey, are we shooting for today or tomorrow to get in the water? McCarthy. Oh, yo, you were talking to me. Oh, well, I was giving you guys some practice. Red all season. Oh, Shake shut off. up. You ready? Uh-oh. Speaking of, oh, my kill switch isn't it. Oh, I'm an idiot.
keys ran perfect. Everything is good. We fixed my drift car. That's What's up with the clutch on that thing? On what? Oh, the, I fixed it. You did you? Yeah, I'm all set. Exit, twin disc? Exit, yeah, ORC, triple. Oh, yeah, we're good. All right, we're done. Wow, drinking water too. You're being responsible. Yeah, that's the first for everything. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's ride again before it gets before it snows. Yeah, that's it. Do you have like a cool saying you say at the end of all your videos? It's not like this, Grant out or something. The video's like, not you over yet. Oh, but did you do Papa John's? Better ingredients, better pizza. Papa John's sponsored by. How sick would that be? All right, later, McCarthy. Fuck. <laughs>